part three. Hello, Dr. Green. I'm here to talk to you about my work placement. Oh yes, uh, it's a uh, it's a holiday, isn't it? Yes. And so, uh, which work placement they have you chosen? I decided to go for the Orient Stadium placement. The event I'll be managing is one where I'm helping to set up a sports competition for primary school children. Yeah, that's always a popular placement, even though it can be tougher than I should think uh, working with children. I know, but it's the uh, fresh air that attracts me. Organizing some skinchos doesn't have the same appeal, even though I might be fun. It might be fun. <clears throat> okay, so obviously safe, safety is going to be one of your key concerns for this event. Yes, I've already thought about that. I'll <coughs> need to make sure none of the equipment's damaged. Ah, oh, well. I shall be working with schools, so the equipment will be their responsibility. However, on the ground and uh, what goes on there uh, will be yours. Oh, I see. And that will include keeping everyone within the boundary of once they are in their kit and on feet. Exactly. She will need to inspect areas so like changing rooms as well for anything someone can a trip over but um, your main priority will be not to lose anyone right i need staff to help with that and uh, don't forget about the spectators mm. i was thinking that uh, many of them will be parents uh, who could help run the event I wouldn't rely on that, and they'll be uh, more interested in filming the children than volunteering. I'll need to make sure uh, they don't interfere with events like that. <laughs> and uh, that's not always easy, especially uh, given a proud parents of trying to get a snap for their child and uh, you want them to move elsewhere okay how about about the scheduling with the sporting events there are all sorts of things that can alter the timetable like rain for instance though so far uh, we've always been lucky with that yeah and uh, i was thinking about what to do uh, if uh, someone got hurt as well I know that last year uh, that caused a terrible delay. Uh, you have to be prepared for such things. Oh, uh, what if a match ends in the draw? Uh, do you let the team keep going until someone wins? Uh, that will be up to you. And again, I should need to plan for it. Right. Now, the aim of a work placement is to give you the opportunity to develop the skills that an event manager needs so uh, let's uh, talk about those a bit well i think my communication skills are pretty good uh, i can talk on the phone uh, to people and uh, book venues and uh, that kind of thing good just remember it's it isn't only about uh, what you say if you meet someone face to face and want to persuade them and to be a sponsor, for example, oh, I'd address up for that. Sure. Good. Uh, let's go on and think about as your organizational skills as you are working in a very uh, people pleased industry, and that means things uh, won't always go to plan. I guess it's being prepared and to make changes to that matter. And that's right. I assume we have to make an on the spot change to a timetable because of a problem you hadn't anticipated. 
Just do it, okay. Uh, how is your time management to this date? I'm uh, working on it. I'm certainly better when I have a deadline, um, which is why uh, this work suits me. Yes, but it's uh, how you respond as that deadline approaches. I know. I've got to look clean even if I'm in a panic. Just to think to yourself, I no one I must know I'm under pressure. Yeah, even though I am of multitasking like crazy. Another skill and that events manage event events manager such need is creativity. Often as your client has a what we call the big picture idea, but it's up to the events manager to think of all the fine points. Uh, that go to uh, making it work right so i need to listen carefully and to that uh, idea and to that fill in all the gaps that's right and uh, you will have a team working under you so another key skill is the leadership your team may have uh, lots of ideas too but uh, you've got to uh, make the ultimate choices do we have refreshments inside or out, for example? Uh, isn't it better to be democratic? Uh, it's a nice idea, but uh, you have the ultimate responsibility. Uh, you believe in uh, what you think best, and be prepared to say yes. And that's a good idea, but uh, it won't work here. I see. Uh, what do you mean? Um, what about the networking side of things? I know it's an idea that a lot of students worry about because we don't have much experience to offer others. But even without it, you can still be an interesting person with useful ideas and the more people you impress the better, I guess so that can help me when I apply for a real job. Exactly. Think ahead. Remember what your ambitions are and keep them in mind. Definitely. Part 3. Questions 21 to 30. Uh, questions 21 to 24. And choose the correct letter A, B or C. Holly's work placement tutorial. Holly has chosen the Orient Stadium Prismatic course. It is outdoors. Which aspect of the safety does Dr. Green emphasize most? And children children stay in the stadium. What does Dr. Green say about the spectators? And they can be hard to manage. What has affected the schedule in the past? An injury. Questions 25 to 30. What do Holly and her tutor agree is an important aspect of uh, each of the following events management skills? Choose six answers from the box and write the correct letter A to H next to questions 25 to 30. Important aspects Events management skills Communication uh, Having a smart appearance C. Organization. Being flexible. A. Time management. Hiding your emotions. Creativity. Focusing on details. Leadership. Uh, trusting your own views. Networking. Thinking of the future, edge.